guys, Kat here, and we are in day 23. Ugh. We are in day 23, that's better, of our Warrior Challenge. Today we have cardio, and it's not very long, but we're using dumbbells, so that's gonna make it way more challenging. I'll be using a 10 pound dumbbell, but you're gonna use whatever weight is best for you, and if that means no weight at all, or even just like a water bottle, then use that. Still go through the same motions, I mean our arms still weigh a good amount of weight, so do what you gotta do. Every exercise will be 45 seconds on with 15 seconds rest. All right, let's get warmed up. All right, guys, nice and easy jumping jacks. Touch the hands at the top, jump the feet out. Over here, remember you can always tap out instead. That's totally okay. This is your workout, so modify where you need to. Let's keep going. Three, two, one, and modify the skater. So stretch to the side, and then bring the other leg in back of you. Let's go ahead and twist that arm. We're just getting our core warmed up, just getting that uh, coordination going. And getting those legs moving. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Three, two, one, and go ahead and bounce it out. All right, from here, you're gonna take that right leg, bring your knee up and kick. Knee up, kick. Keep stabilizing on that left leg. Nice, powerful kick because we're powerful people. Powerful. <laughs> Keep going, and let's go ahead and switch. Shake, shaky, and switch. Yeah, and kick. Nice job, guys. Oh, be so strong. Finish it out. Let's go three more. That's two. One more. Nice job, go ahead, balance it out again. Rotate those arms forward. Getting those shoulders warmed up. Getting them ready to go. Yes. Oh yes. Three, two, and bring it backwards. Keep bouncing it out. You can take the bounce out if you want to. You're just not feeling it. That's okay. And let's go two more. Big circles. One more. Nice job. Crisscross those arms. Let's really think about opening up the chest, squeezing that back. It is 30 degrees Fahrenheit right now, so it's a little cold, but it's pretty warm for January in Wisconsin. Like, that's, it's kind of crazy and awesome, so I'm feeling super blessed right now. Three, two, one, nice job. Go ahead, hands on the hips, a few neck rolls, all the way. In these movements, especially when we add weight, we tend to bring in those traps and that neck, and we don't want to tighten them up. We don't want to be all shrugged up like this. So just loosey-goosey it up. Get that awesome rotation, feel that stretch. Really pull your neck a little bit over to the sides as you roll over, and a few hip circles here. Gotta warm up those hips, get them ready. Get them ready. All the way around, like SpongeBob. And then bring it back around, other way. All the way around. Woo! Whee! <laughs> this workout's gonna go by super fast, do Let's go one more. And shake, shakey. Oh yeah, shake, shakey, eggs and bakey. Buckets. Kick that booty. Yeah. We're getting warm. We're getting ready. Almost there. Three, two, one, and let's go ahead and have those arms out wide. Feet out wide. Last one in our warm up. Go ahead, seal jacks. Bring your hands together right in the middle. And use this time to open up the chest again. Squeeze your back as you bring your arms back. Jump those feet even wider than before. Now that our legs are more warmed up, and ready to go. Right. We're gonna get started. Three, two, one. Let's do this. Okay, 15 seconds. So I'm gonna grab my 10 pound dumbbell. Again, you don't need to use as much. We're gonna start nice and easy. So we're gonna go three side to side hops. One, two, three. And then a nice free throw with that dumbbell. So we're jumping up high, pressing that dumbbell up. So again, one, two, three, press it up. 
One, two, three, don't hit the ceiling. <laughs> One, two, three, there's this black object up there that I don't want to hit. <laughs> Keep it going. One, two, three. Remember, you don't have to use weight. If you just want to use your arms, that's okay. Do whatever you got to do. Do whatever you got to do. Finish it out. One, two, three. One, two, three, hop, one, two, three, and hop. Okay, so back lunge chop with a knee up hop is next. Sounds like a lot, it's not too bad. What we're gonna do is you're going to step back with your left leg, chop with your right, and then hop. <laughs> and let's do it, Woo. So back lunge and hop. Sink down, back lunge. You don't have to go for speed. Oh yeah. Sink down. If it's too much to do a pogo hop, just jump with both feet instead. Chop and jump. Keep it going. Woo. Up. Woo. Drive those knees up, or that knee up. Sink down. Drive it up. Drive it up. Sink it. Really think about twisting through that body so we get those obliques. Ah. <laughs> that right leg is on fire. All right. What we're going to do next is, oh, fun. <laughs> fun, fun, fun. Come into a lunge in that right uh, leg again. You're going to sink down, touch it, come up, knee pull, kick, and then pivot again. Sink down, pivot. Knee pull, kick, and down. Sink it, come up. Knee pull, kick. Once you get that pattern down, you can start adding speed. Now, try to keep your back flat. When you sink down, you don't have to touch the ground. Keep it going. Keep going, guys. Knee pull, kick. Stinky. Pivot. Knee pull, kick, turn, and one more. We have time. All right, so back lunge and chop, knee up is next again. This time on the other leg. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, baby. Twist and hop and twist and hop. If you're like, cat, yeah, I want more cardio, go ahead, twist. You can add a talk instead. <laughs> you asked for it. <laughs> if that's what you want, go for it. I'm good. I'm working on my stabilizers, working on my back lunge, getting my cardio, get my heart rate up. I'm good. Ugh. Keep it going. Sink it. Hop it. Nice job, guys. Ugh. Sink. Whoop. <laughs> All right, back lunge. Not back lunge. A lunge. And then we're going to do again. Sink down, pivot, knee pull, and kick. This time, other leg. So get ready with that left leg for this time. Back flat. Knee pull, kick. Sink down, pivot. Knee pull, kick. Oh yeah. Sink. Down. Knee pull, kick. Real powerful kick here. Knee pull, kick. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're completing this day together. Because we're strong and because we can. Keep going because you can. Uh, tell yourself you're strong. 
had to have a self talk with myself before filming. But today, I was feeling a little tired. Turned the camera on. And I looked at myself and I'm like, yeah, you're strong. You're lucky to be able to move. Do the things you love doing. Just do it. Right, so chest is going to be up. We have two squat touchdowns. One, then you're going to switch. Two, then ten high knees. So, one, two, hold it. One, two, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten. Do it again. One, two, up, two, four, six, seven, nine, ten. Yes. So if you ever need to go to a mirror, look at yourself. Be like, I'm strong. I'm awesome. I can do whatever I want. I can do this workout. <laughs> Oh yeah, 
<laughs> Speaking of quads, they're gonna love you in the next one. Whew. Whew. Press, sink down, press. Whew. Okay, I don't know why I do this next one. <laughs> so we're gonna start off into a lunge, three switch lunges. I'm getting warm. Okay, so let's do it. Three switch lunges. One, two, three, single leg, press. You can add a hop to it. Two, three, come up, hop. Because it is cardio. <laughs> Might as well hop. Sink it. One, two, three, bring it up, and hop. Drop that weight if you need to. Hop. Ooh. I don't want you, but my legs feeling it from the week. One, two, three, uh, three, two, one. Oh, fun. Okay. Four switch feet, two 180 surfers. So switch feet real close to each other. Nothing too crazy. We're gonna go one foot in front of the other. One, two, three, surf, 180, surf. One, two, three, as if the quads didn't get enough. One, two, three. So notice how you can jump in the middle and then add the surfer, or you can go right into surfer, surfer. One, two, four, the um, ladder will be more challenging. One, two, four. Sink it, sink it. One, two, four. Whoo, quads. Ha. Dumbbell swing and jump. So for this next one, um, you can make it just ah, whatever. I'm too busy. Okay, so what you want to do is Grab it like this. Remember, it's not a squat, so hinge on the hips, squeeze your butt. Now, once you get this down, if you feel ready, you're gonna add a hop at the top. Hop. So make sure you're not hopping while it's swinging. I don't want to exasperate your lower back. You're hopping it when it's in the air for that second. Wow, I can hear so much better. I thought my really hat. It's like I was in a fishbowl before. <laughs> That's the thing about hats. It's like someone says to me, I'm like, what? And then they say it three more times, and I'm like, what? <laughs> I swear, I'm listening. <sighs> All right, next up, three point press. Whoo, two crisscross. So it's like your gift giving. I like to call it gift giving. What you want to do is pretend you're giving a gift. One, two. Three, and then we're gonna crisscross twice. So press, 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 crisscross two times. You can alternate which leg goes in front if you want to, um, but if it's too much thinking, you don't have to. So yeah, it's like you're giving a gift, and then you're like, wait, I just realized I like it more. <laughs> and then you take it back. <laughs> That's awful. Or is it? Happy birthday to me. One, two, one, two, three. Keep out, guys. One, two, one, two, three. One, two, keep going. One, don't keep going, because we're done. All right, three vertical hops, single leg squat. All right, so what we want to do is, you're going to have dumbbell in front again. We're going to sink down, keep your back nice and flat. Sink down, one, two, sink down, three, and then really come down to the ground with that dumbbell. Stabilize. Sink down a little bit, one, two, going for a height here. Three, working on stability. Now, if it's too much for you, just sink down, hop, one, two, three, and you can stabilize on one leg, or you can stick the back lunge. Okay, so a few options for you. 
One, two. Don't hit yourself in the face with that dumbbell, please. One, two, three. All right, next up. We're almost done. All right, dumbbell plank carry over burpee. So start it with your right hand. What you're gonna do is start on your left side, come down to a burpee. From here, carry it over, come up, jump, down, carry it over, come up, jump, down, carry it over, come up, jump, down, carry it over, up, and jump. Oh. <laughs> Cardio with weights is so fun. You'll notice why you carry that dumbbell over. You really gotta use your core. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. We only have three moves after this. You're fine. You're fine. All the way. All right, next up. Dumbbell thrusters. Oh, jeez. Okay. Grab both weights. Sorry about this. <laughs> so, squat, thrust, sink it, press it. One, two, three, four. And then come down. Now, if it's too much weight, drop a weight, sink down, press. One, two, three, four. To be honest, I'm going to keep it um, with just this weight. Sing down, press it if you want your arms up to make it more challenging, go for it. Um, I found that just now, by having my arms up using both dumbbells, I felt in my lower back. I was hyperextending my spine. And we don't want that. One, two, four. Okay, half burpee. Okay, this is fun. So, put your dumbbells right here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna sandwich our feet in between them when we jump up. Okay. So, jump up, bring it up, hop, bring it down, back, up, back flat, hop, bring it down. Oh. Keep going, down, up, up. Oh. We have one more move, guys. And then we are stretching. And I am shaving my head because this hair is ridiculous. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I had a hair tie and it was on my shirt. And then when I took my long sleeve off, <laughs> it flew off and I'm like, I don't have time. <laughs> I must instruct. <laughs> Down, up, up. All right, so weighted knee pulls. Last move. So we're gonna skip it. Now, if you can't skip it, you're just gonna walk it out. Let's do it. Okay, knee pulls. Exhale, every time you drive your knee out. Go side to side, go back and forth, go in a circle, 
whatever is best for you. And let's go ahead, arms into a T. Drop those hips over to the left. Keep your shoulder blades on the ground as much as you can. Look over your right shoulder. <coughs> I refuse to get sick. I don't want to get sick. <laughs> you gotta be back to center. Other side. Switch. One side might be tighter than the other. Keep breathing. Woo. Okay. And go ahead. Bring it back to center. Let's bring um, bottoms of the feet together into a butterfly. Hands right onto the stomach. And then go ahead and bring your shoulder blades underneath you a little bit, adjust a little bit. Big inhale through that nose. Exhale through the mouth. Inhale through that nose. Exhale through the mouth. And then just think about all the things you want to bring into your life, all those happy feelings, everything, all those positive thoughts. Think about them right now. And as you inhale, think about inhaling them in. As you exhale, exhale out all the negativity, anything that's holding you down, exhale it out. See ya. You know anything you're done, you're done, you're gone. <laughs> Go ahead, bring those knees together. Roll around onto that stomach. So if you ever need that time, if you're at the office or anything, just think about it. You're breathing in all the positivity and exhaling out all the stuff, unneeded thoughts, anxiety, anything that you have. You can do that. And grab the chest and come onto those knees. Let's do another yoga. Cool thing. Go ahead, inhale. Round that back, press the palms, fingertips in the ground, chin the chest, belly button, spine, exhale. Open up that chest. Inhale, breathe in. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. One more. Inhale. Exhale. Nice job. Shake it out. Shake your hippies. Do a little circles if you want to. Do what makes you happy. Just get goofy with it. You can be like, woo, woo. That's fine. Just don't hurt yourself. <laughs> and watch out for your hair. Just sweep the ground. And then sit back into child's pose. Relax your neck. Press the palms to the ground. Hands over to the right. Breathe. Bring back to start. Or left, left side. Back to center. Walk the hands over to the knees. And breathe here. Woo. Now if you want to stay here, you can. If you want to come up to the knees, you can. What you're going to do is you're going to relax your neck entirely. We're going to take that right hand, bring it to the left side of that neck. Again, relax your neck. You're going to pull. And you can take your left arm and bring it out to the side. Find where it's super tight. Stay there and breathe. Think about that tight muscle melting as you breathe air and oxygen into it. Amazing. It's like magic. Slowly bring it back to center. A few, few no's here. No. No. And go ahead and relax the neck on the other side. Well, it might, you might find that's tight in a different area on this side. There it is. Stay there and breathe. And slowly bring it back. This time, head. Yes, I love working out with Kat. She's awesome. Wow, amazing. <laughs> I'm going to shake you, shake you. We're going to curl the toes underneath. Push those hips back, straighten out the legs here through the hamstrings. Keep relaxing your neck. <sighs> Slowly roll it up. Four, three, two, one. Roll the shoulder blades. We're almost there. Left arm comes across the body and pull over that left shoulder. Breathe here. <sighs> And shake it out on the other side. 
breathing. And shake it out. Last one, guys. Clasp those hands in front. Pull the shoulders in. Big inhale up. And exhale, sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. We are done with the door. We did it. You guys did it. We completed day 23 of our Warrior Challenge. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Please do like this video before you go. Thank you. And also share it with your friends, family on Facebook, Twitter, etc. It helps me out so much. Um, if you do want to support my channel and you guys are loving, loving, loving this challenge so much, and you guys are seeing a difference, you're feeling great, uh, I do have a link down in my description to support my channel, and that would be amazing. And then let me know in the comments below how you guys are doing. Uh, let me know your favorite move today. I will see you guys for day 24, and I hope you guys have an amazing day. Roar!